Hi, this is Chris McCurgan again, and um, I'm showing you one of the programs I'm making in a moment. This is my coursework for my A-level project, and it's called Capture King. It's a simple chess program that works for a LAN network. I'm just going to show you a few things here. It's, it's in the process. You can move pieces around. Um, you can take pieces, and when you take them, it comes to the graveyard, as I'm showing you up here. Um, but the rulings aren't set, like that black pawn just took that king in one move. But um, you can't take your own piece, comes up with a little error message. Uh, blank squares can't take other pieces, and that took much more effort than I thought to program. Um, it looks a bit messy and not really well put together, but it is in the process. So you can do nice neat little things like I'll show you here. You can edit board color. You just like any window color you can choose. Let's go for let's go for blue. Nice little blue for you. And there you go. The board color's changed. And when you close the form, that will save it to a file. And when you open it up again, the board color will change to what you set it to. You can also change the actual board color itself, not just the background color. Uh, choose any color again. Okay, and now the second color for it. And now we have a nice green and pinky color there. It looks beautiful, doesn't it? Um, just do nice things like make the graveyard disappear. Um, uh, there's a little chat utility so you could talk to other people on the LAN network. So the idea being you could talk to people, see what different um, abilities and stuff they have, which isn't there yet, but and you could ask them, invite them to games, and the game window would pop up and you can go start playing away. So yeah, it, it's still in the process, it's my coursework. So um, this is a little statistics window. My the aim of my chess program is to record loads, loads of different statistics about what you do, and you could boast it off to your friends or something. It, um, here is it, it's a bit of a copy of the Xbox. You gain different achievements doing different things. So um, this one here on the left is for winning a game, and the one on the right there is for uh, winning 50 games. It just gives you a little thing to do whilst playing, I guess. So um, yeah, that that's my coursework in a moment. It's June and Easter, so I'll update you then and give you a bit more feedback and perhaps upload onto the net so people can have a swing around with it.